we're going to be uh, brief, uh, we're going to be fast, and we're going to make things, I know we have a short time. Welcome to the month of February, and the prophetic theme for the month of February is, I am fortified for greatness. I am fortified for greatness. I am fortified for greatness. We extract that from the book of Joshua chapter 1 verse 1 to 9. Because of time, we can't read it. But let me just read a little bit. It says, Moses, my servant, is dead. We use it for, 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 uh, for prayer right now. Say, Moses, my servant, is dead. That is verse 2. He said, get going. You cannot, <laughs> you cannot live today on yesterday's message. You have to know what is there. Moses, my servant, is there. The information that I'm using yesterday is there. Now, expose yourself to the new one. Moses, very powerful statement. Moses, my, you know, you, until you recognize the death of Moses, you will not get going. God instructed Joshua to get going. So this month is a month of building capacity. Because you have to go. You have to make things happen. You have to stand up. You have to run. Because there is no time to check time. And because checking up time is a waste of time. So get going. Cross this Jordan River. You and all the people. Cross to the country. I am giving to the people of Israel. I am giving you every square inch of the land you set your feet on. Just as I promised Moses. From the wilderness and this Lebanon east to the great river of Ephraim river and the entire country then west of the great sea it is all yours it cannot be all yours until you get going lift up your right hand I will get going I will, get I will going. not be static I will not be in the mighty name of Jesus Amen. so it's my mode of capacity building capacity building Capacity building to be able to do what God says you should do. Capacity building your body to be able to move in the pace of life that God has instructed you. Every Wednesday, we'll be working ourselves through what I tied to that. I can do all things. I can do all things. From Philippians chapter 4, verse 13. I can do all things. Somebody shout hallelujah. Hallelujah. Somebody shout hallelujah. Holy Spirit take over tonight and within the short time we're going to be using study being an introduction to the, the Wednesday and to this month. Lord empower us. Give us a word and bless the people in Jesus mighty name. Amen. Amen. Please note Wednesday is I can do all things and the teaching says for Sunday is understanding the demand. The demands of greatness. Understanding the demand of greatness. Because of time, tonight I'll be I'm titled to this <coughs> message under the teaching series. I can do all things. I'm titled, I can do all things. Of course, it's Philippians chapter 4, verse 13. When there's this straight statement from Paul, he said, I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. And today, the second day of the month of February in the year 2022, the title for today's message to when is the East. Understanding the charges of life. I'm not telling you about charging that you swap your card. To charge somebody is to instruct that person, is to command that person on what must be done. You have fasted, you have prayed. Now, this today, God said, I have charges for you. The things that must get your attention, I have charges for you. The thing that must command your yourself. Look at verse 9 of Joshua chapter 1. Verse 9. Joshua chapter 1, verse 9. He said, I have not command, have I not commanded you? You see? see there's, no, there's no time for all this. I have commanded you. Charges make you strong. If that's not enough, when David was about to die, the Bible said in 1 Kings chapter 2, verse 1, 
First Kings chapter 2, verse 1. He said, Now the days of David draw near that he should die. Look at what happened. And he charged him. Solomon his son. He charged him. Remember, you have a good phone and your phone run out of battery. That means the Bible, I, I, I said the Bible, the people said, Your phone is not what? It's not charged. Your level of the level of the charges that you receive will determine the capacity at which you will run. The things that must be done, that must be done now, now, that must be done fast, fast. You need to know this. David commanded him. He said, Do this. Remember to keep the, the status of the law. If you keep it, this will happen. If you don't, this was going to happen. Look at what happened. In Joshua chapter 11, verse 15. Joshua 11, verse 15. The Bible said, As the Lord has commanded Moses, a servant, so Moses commanded Joshua, or use another word, he charges Joshua. He said, This is what God said I should do. But unfortunately, I can't complete this assignment. Then I'm charging you to make sure that this, uh, these things are done. Look at what he said. And so Joshua did it. So charges are assignments that must be accomplished in due time. Charges are assignments that must be accomplished in due time. Charges are assignments that must be accomplished in due time. Charges are assignments that must be accomplished in due time. The Bible says, He left nothing undone. Of all that the Lord had commanded Moses, God did not command uh, what they call Joshua, but God commanded Moses, and Moses commanded. Let me tell you something. You can, if you don't want to become a mentor, later, you must look for a mentor. If you don't want to become a mentor, later, if you don't want to become a trap, you must be trained. Did you hear that? If you don't want to become a mentor later, you must look for a mentor. If you don't want to be trash, you must be trained. Those who end up inside trash are those who don't have respect for training. What is training? The capacity to remove you from mediocre. The capacity to what? To, to remove it, it when you are trained, when you are mentored. You will escape average the charges. Receiving the charges of life. That's what I call today's title. Receiving the charges of life. 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 You need to know. For every purpose, there is a bishop. From every bishop, there are must be things that must be done line upon line precept upon precept look for that scripture it's in Proverbs 24 he said do not remove the ancient landmark that, that has been given to your fathers you know people think they can just do whatever they want believe in the Lord your God you will be established and believe in his prophet you will prosper so prosperity is not in the work that you do is in the faith in your pastor. Hey, hey. Jeremiah chapter 3, verse 15. And I will appoint a, a prophet, a teacher that will teach you. There are people that must that you must listen to. No, the Lord gives you the bread and uh, the bread of adversary, but he will not remove your teacher away from you. This is the way working. Do you see that? There are things God will never reveal to you. Hey, wrote to me, slow down. What are you talking about? I'm telling you, there are things that it must be revealed to you through people. <laughs> if not, that means God is breaking the, 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 the law of chain of command. There's a law like that. So what I'm here to tell you tonight are the charges that God is giving us. As a member, in alignment of fresh starts. In alignment to the secret things God tells me to teach. In alignment to the building of the king and queen. In the, because our, our church is not just a church as usual. As usual. It's a palace. In, each service is a palace. It's a palace where king addresses his kingsmen, 
and addresses the, the queen, addresses the, the princess and the, and, the, and the prince on what must be done. Let me give us some definition and some charges that we learned of today's only brief. What is, what are charges or what is charge? However you want to put it. Either are or is. Of course, if you are talking about plural or singular, you know what, you don't have this or you don't have this. Amen. Mm -hmm. What is a charge? Or what are charges? Number one. Charges are the ethical standard and non-negotiable decrees. They are ethical standard, moral, what, the things that make life to run. They are non negotiable decree. They are, not, they are the decree that don't think of your, they don't think of you. They think of what God says as instructed by people who are going around, which must be upheld or has been upheld <laughs> by the founder. These are ethical standards and non negotiable decrees which have been upheld. Up Held, past tense, upheld, upheld, okay? It has been upheld by the founders, the people that God spoke to direct. Of organization, or a group, or a family, or a country, or a state, that must be made aware. The responsibility of those persons in charge of it is to, he must tell you. If that person, that's why God said, if I tell, if I'm bringing arrow on these people and you don't tell them, he said, if they die, their blood, what, comes upon you. Proverbs 22, 28. You don't need to read it yet. Proverbs 22, 28. You need to know. 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 I will take the name. Organization or group of people. Over the years, that must be that must be made aware. You don't have charges. You must be. It must be declared. It must be made known and kept. Can I tell you? Because I want this thing to be written, please. I will start all over again. Charge are the ethical standard and non-negotiable decrees, which must be up, which, which has been sorry, which has been upheld by the founders of a group, organization, or people over the years that must be made aware and kept and uphold by the new generation also embrace for the purpose of sustaining the rituals and keeping alive the labor of the heroes. Labor of the euro, the investment of the funders and the truth that is not negotiable. Truth is truth. Every winner knows Matthew 6 33. They know the faith. So you will never hide the charges. Let me give you an example. In the military, US Air Force, when you make E1 to E4. Nobody give you any charge. You can make mistake. Anytime you step into the realm of staff sergeant, technical sergeant, immediately when you're about to be pinned, every one of you will line up here and they will bring down to paper. And they will say, they will say this word. They say, you are charged with ensuring that personnel and resources under your control are effectively used. You are charged with remaining and with maintaining a lot to, de to detecting adverse moral trends and initial corrective action within your control, providing up providing appropriate feedback to your supervisor, and they will be listening. To you. you are charged, you are charged because of reason you can go online and take yourself. You are charged. With activities encouraging, motivating, and something, something, something. You are charged ensuring that people are treated fairly. You are charged with always wearing the uniform properly. You are charged with a personal, with personal responsibility to take advantages 
of all and all during education, you are charged. And after the session, they said, Did you accept this charge? And they are not telling sure they will say, Yes, I do. That's when you are fit to be in rank. So, rank is not enough that you make rank. You must take the charges that come with it. As a believer, it's not enough that you go to church. You must take the charges. That's why I call it receiving the charges of life. Receiving the charges of life. You know, I found the message version very powerful. That is why I, I chose it. Look at some words that God said to, uh, to Joshua. He said, All your life, no one will be able to hold out against you. In the same way, I was with Moses, I will be with you. I would give up on you. Look at what the change God has, the dangerous thing God is releasing into the hard life of Moses. Joshua, he said, I won't give up on you. I won't leave you. He said, strength, courageous. That's what God said to me. The, the, the message version of it. He said, you are going to lead these people. Not do you think of leading these people? That's why I call it hard. That's why I get that paper. God did not seek what he thinks. He said, hey, you are the one. Look at verse 2. He said, Moses, my servant is dead. Get going. You cannot be living on yesterday's information. He said, you, these people, you will live there. Not do you feel like, not do you think like. Listen, anytime you trust the wrong person with power, that person will die. You know, I was telling somebody yesterday, I said, do you know why Sarah died before Abraham? Eh? The person said, you know, I said, let me teach you. Anytime you let a woman take a lead in a home, you are, you are, you are, you are, you are putting fire on her. Hey, hey, Abraham, sleep with my, uh, my, my maid. And without consultation, he went ahead, sleep with the maid. Maid gave birth to trouble. The same woman that advised the man, go and meet the woman. May my sin come upon you. When Abraham want to react, God said, no, no, don't react. Do what you, what, what you want. Ah, God, you know what put that with you. God said, don't worry. Do what you want. Send the guy away. away. Abraham did. Let me tell you something. Bible, you know, this is not, Bible is not written, American is not the one who write Bible. Nigeria doesn't write Bible. Education does not write Bible. Bible is infallible word of God that is sustained over infinity period that cannot be adjusted or be, or, 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 or be, or be messed up by men. When I was meditating, the Lord said, <laughs> this might be hard. I won't say it. It's going to be hard. Let me tell you something. God be help us in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. He said, you are going to lead these people to inherit the land that I promised to give to their ancestors. He said, give it everything you are. It's in the Bible there. Give it everything you are. Your heart and your soul. Make sure you carry out the, re the revelation that Moses commanded you. Somebody shout at the Somebody shout at the Somebody shout at the VA. So, charges are set up that keeps you going not to be confused. When you are given responsibility, God give you charges. Charges are not just set up that keep you going to know for you not to be confused. Studies are links between the going action and the continuing action. The thing that has been done before you and the thing that you must carry to keep going. Number three, charges are things that are set, that started by one that must be continuing by others. Somebody shout hallelujah. Because of time. God gave me 10 charges I need to give to you as a random tonight. You are charged to be the head and not the tail. At the end of it, you say I do. <laughs> I'll start again. You are charged to be the head and not the tail. I do. No, I the head when I finish everything. But I'll tell you this. You are charged to be above and not beneath. You are charged to be healthy and not sick. 
You are charged to live and not die. You are charged to have abundance and not penury. You are charged to be employers of labor and not just be employed. You are charged to build houses and not just be a tenant. You are charged to lead and not just follow. You are charged to be great and not be yoga. You are charged to be strong and not weak. Do you receive these charges? I do. Yes, I do. I, do. I decree those charges will come upon you. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. You will never be weak. Amen. You will never be fine among the weak yokas. Amen. You will, not, you will not just be a follower, you will be a leader. Amen. You will be a you will not just you you will build houses and live in it. Amen. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. You will be employers of labor. Amen. You will live in abundance. Amen. You will live and not die. Amen. You will be healthy all the days of your life. Amen. You will be above in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. You will be the head and not the tail. In the mighty name of Jesus. Let us run up tonight with this just this daily word. What must you do to carry out child? Be strong, be courageous. And be a reader of the word. If you don't know what has been written, you will miss it. Stand up on your friend. The only thing God is telling you, he said, No, 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 no. God said, I'm not here to tell you what to do. Go and do what Moses tells you. But what I'm telling you, what? Be strong and be courageous. And he told him in verse 6, This book of the law shall not depart of you. You see? I decree in the mighty name of Jesus. May you never waste these charges Amen. that God has given to you. Amen. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Receiving the charges of life. Lift up your hand. Lord, I receive the capacity. Lord, I receive the capacity. To deliver. To deliver. In Jesus' mighty name. Amen. If you are here, you are watching me and you know and you know and you know that uh, you are still struggling. You have not even known God. If you don't know God, I don't want to charge you. But I'm telling you tonight, God is ready for you. Left hand up, right hand on your chest, and say this after me. Lord Jesus, I'm all yours. I know that you died for me. On the third day, you rose up again and will be justified. Right now, my sins are forgiven. I'm a new creature in Christ Jesus. All things have passed away. All things have become new in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Receive the capacity to come into the circle of God Amen. through Christ Jesus. Amen. And receive the charges for you to be done. That will be done on earth through your hand. Amen. In Jesus' mighty name, amen. amen. We take this communion. This communion will receive the charges of life amen. in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Nobody will be behind. Amen. As we take those charges, you run with it. Amen. In Jesus' mighty name, amen, amen, amen. 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 It's often time. Father, this is to you. We have not come here empty. Let this be offering of our capacity building. Amen. Nobody listening up to me right now will be below standard at the end of the month. Amen. They are not permitted Amen. to be below standard. Amen. By this offering, everybody knows what to do. The strength Amen. for continuity. The good help to live our life. Amen. Receiving the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. So shall it be. In Amen. Jesus' mighty name. Amen. 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 Praise the Lord. Amen. Lift up your hand and receive the name. And bless the name of the Lord. Say, God, we thank you. Amen. Thank you. Father, we thank you. Thank in you, Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Tonight, Amen. be blessed. Amen. As you have this, receive those charges, receive the strength, Amen. the courage, Amen. and the capacity to read, to know what to do. Amen. In Jesus' mighty name. Amen. 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 Saturday is going to be our leadership uh, program. We're going to come back to it. The time will be revealed tomorrow on our page. Be blessed with Jesus. Let us share the goodness. Surely, God's goodness and mercy shall follow us all the days of our lives. And we shall bless you, as our Lord. Amen. 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 God bless you. I am starting fresh. God bless you. It's my year of a new beginning. As the Lord reigns, we shall feel strong. strong. Congratulations. Amen. Amen. And amen. Give somebody a knife. I'm starting fresh. I'm